This archived clip from Make Live is brought to you by DigiKey. Join us live every second and fourth Wednesday of the month. Yeah. So uh, now we're going to show you around the lab. Great. Uh, intern Nick is going to show us, and uh, we're going to head over there. All right. So this camera, so hey Nick, how's it going? Hey Becky, good, you? Yeah, great. So this camera's on wheels, and I'm going to follow you around the lab. Does that sound pretty good? Sounds good. So here's the mic. Okay, thanks. I hope you're uh, better driving the camera than you are at steering the uh, drill cart. Ha! ha. Uh, so starting off uh, this way, we have the machine room. Uh, two of the main features are going to be the uh, mini metal lathe from Craftsman, as well as the uh, mini uh, little machine shop uh, high-speed mill. Um, we also keep most of our power tools, accessories, drills, combos, whatnot in here. Um, as we venture around the corner, uh, there's a materials room where all of the interns have uh, a little space to keep ongoing projects so that the lab can stay clean. Uh, we also keep uh, miscellaneous bits, parts, bolts, nuts, uh, materials uh, that we use to build the projects. Um, around the corner here, we have my favorite room. It's the machine shop. Uh, in it, we have two laser cutters. Uh, a pretty new one to the lab is a uh, 40 watt full spectrum. Uh, it's a liquid cooled, uh, smaller uh, cutting uh, surface area than the 60 watt epilogue that we have. Uh, we also have been in contact with ShopBot and we helped them to develop one of their Tyro systems. It was a prototype for what is now the desktop CNC machine from uh, their company. Uh, so it was really cool giving them feedback and uh, talking to them about what we could make it, make it better. Uh, as we go around here, we have uh, the MakerBot. Uh, Thingomatic, um, next to uh, the arcade display, which is probably gets pretty good use in here. Uh, runs off of the uh, computer screen, um, simple, cool setup. Uh, we have a really cool project coming out of Make 28 that'll actually show you how to hook up um, controls to your own computer. Uh, around this way, we have the pegboard, as seen before, a lot of the hand tools that we use, and then it kind of opens up to this bigger space where we have the ma uh, Make Workshop. And so a lot of this is just used for drilling, hammering, uh, cutting, grinding, uh, just open space for the make interns to kind of build the projects and test uh, to make sure that, you know, what we do in the lab is we make sure that um, the projects that go into the magazine, the majority of them, you know, we, we test them, we edit them, and we make sure that, uh, that uh, the content is accurate. Um, over here we have the electronics workbench, the circuitry, the batteries, uh, tons of cables. We have the electronics workstation. Uh, as well as uh, sort of new to the lab is this special space that we've designated to uh, guest makers. So if you're ever in uh, Santa Rosa or uh, Sebastopol, uh, feel free to stop by, especially uh, Becky and Matt. Check it out. Uh, space to hack, build, work on projects with us. And um, yeah, that's kind of the lab.